two, one. What? It's me. Right now, millions of people are just like opening for it and they're like, what? They're seeing this and that's me. That's the littlest snail. Thank you guys. I didn't think I was actually gonna cry. I was just joking. <laughs> There's like so many tears streaming down my face. There's a snail. As soon as she opened it up, she, she does the snail. So nice. <laughs> boy is here. I love you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thanks. Mwah. Can you tell I'm crying? <laughs> she is actually crying. I didn't think I was actually gonna cry. Like I was just like joking about that, and then I couldn't stop crying. Do you cry? Yes. <laughs> is that the right answer? Yeah. I'm very, very proud of you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I love you so much. You've worked so hard to get here. Yeah. True. Toaster said, imagine this. Your locker bundle is going to come back? <laughs> wow. Well. At some point. <laughs> That's a wild part to think of, too. Oh, yeah. Is that you kind of, you, you put your little stamp on, on the history of Fortnite. Biggest game in the world. Yeah. yeah. Best game. Best game. <laughs> the biggest and the best. It's just very monumental and I'm very proud of you. Thank you. I've just been like sitting here looking at a chat moving so fast, like so many people saying like the most dramatically positive stuff ever. And that's making me cry more <laughs> because it's so nice. Look at the, there's so many congrats snails. There's so much you deserve this. Wolfie's spamming the snail. Thank you. Resty says I donated thank you and said I was the first person to buy it. Let's go. Do you a custom game? We can all wear your bundle. Let's do that right now. Sure. Well, let me buy it first. Give me a second. Okay. Down there and buy it. <laughs> okay, in five minutes we'll do it. Um I think it's really important that you are a positive influence in the Fortnite community. Mm -hmm. All these people look up to you. You know, there's a lot of stuff going on in the world and I think it's really, really important that you've uh, made things a little bit nicer for everyone. That was so sweet. Anyways, that's my two cents. Love you. Thank you so much. I just saw someone in chat say I, I'm brand new and I just found you from your locker bundle in the shop. Thank you so much for coming over. I had a scheduled TikTok to come out at seven just when the shop changed over. A lot of Fortnite players are confused about the red galaxy girl who just got a locker bundle today. So I looked into it. The biggest slug is an American content creator with no sense of humor. She is known for her incredibly factual videos about new Fortnite outfits. You may have seen some of her videos on TikTok since she has over seven followers and she's getting really close to 10 subscribers on YouTube. A lot of people don't know this, but she has a really cute white cat named Snail Cat and she hates satire. I think this creator is really funny and that's probably because she's me thank you guys so much for supporting me and these videos i'll keep making them it's because of you that i now have a locker bundle in the game thank you thank you thank you and thank you so much to fortnite for including me this is a dream come true sorry i just want to see if, if fortnite tweeted about this they did hug a friend Fortnite said, hug a friend and slide your way into victories with snails. Handpicked locker bundle. Hug a friend. Fortnite watches my streams. <laughs> Fortnite. I'm literally going to cry again. I'm just looking through the, the messages and the quote retweets on Fortnite's tweet about this. Oh my God. Oh my God. Guys, what the heck is like? Like, what is going on? Okay, wait, I'm going to screenshot. 
screenshot it anytime in the next 48 hours, but thank you, Husky. Husky says, you're in Fortnite now, oh my god. Kabam says, you deserved it, and now you worked very hard. All these years, you have helped people. You made people enjoy themselves. You made people be the happiest in this world. You are a star. <laughs> Kabam! That was so sweet. Everyone's out here typing out speeches. Do you guys know that I started playing Fortnite during the first COVID lockdown? Like on the first day. My like job went from being like super, super in-person social to suddenly being at home. And I went from like talking to so many people a day to nothing like being stuck at home all the time and I was very extroverted and it was really, really hard. So I decided to download Fortnite kind of as a joke because so many people were like joking about how I should try Fortnite for years. And then I decided I would finally try it because I knew that you could talk to random people on it. I instantly fell in love. I honestly, the first game I played, I really, really enjoyed it. I didn't think I would like the shooting aspect of it because I never liked a gun game. I only liked like Skyrim and Stardew Valley and that kind of thing. But I loved it. And the thing I loved the most was talking to random people and working together as a team and getting to talk to random people instead of talking to no one when I played Skyrim. I played it every single day, basically, since March of 2020, like literally the first day of lockdown, the first day of like COVID times. I didn't think I was gonna start a channel. The first time I started thinking about starting a channel was one of my teammates was like talking to me about Chica and I was like, who's that? And then I looked her up and she was so funny and she made videos about like talking to random kids and random squads. And I was like, I could do that too. Like, I love that, that's so funny. And I have com like funny conversations with that all the time. And I finally, in November, decided to do it with my girl versus Renegade Raider. And then I just kept doing it and doing it until I started TikTok. And I don't know, the thought that like I could go from that to this, I could just go from a girl who was lonely during COVID to the littlest snail's locker is insane. Was that inspirational? <laughs> Did that inspire anyone? No? <laughs> was anyone listening? <laughs> okay, do you guys want to do customs? Aw, I talk. you were here? Thank you. I text says you inspire me, Snail. Thank you. <laughs> Husky says that speech made me want to get a job. <laughs> oh my god. Stop. Someone says I am extremely inspired. <laughs> Mickey says little Snail, you hope to shine like a diamond throughout your journey. Keep it up and continue shining forever. That was so cute. Thank you. Mystic bought the bundle with my code. Thank you so much. Remember when I cried? <laughs> Remember when I was crying in front of nearly 400 people? Some of them who like definitely just heard of me for the first time and then they came to my stream and I was crying. I now accept that this happened. It's right in front of me. It's reflecting back on my eyes so aggressively that my eyes are in a green screen. It's just so overwhelming guys. The notifications are insane. I don't know if I've ever had this many notifications. <laughs> And that, and I mean, there was a day last year around this time, there was a day that I got 100,000 new followers in one day. And like met multiple millions of views in that one day. I think I have more, I feel like I have more notifications now. I just have more meaningful notifications now. We're gonna do a custom. I think I'm ready now. 